All right, all right, movie lovers. Got Academy Award winner, Mr. Cuba Gooding Jr. <laughs> Great film. Thank you, sir. What does it, when you leave a film like this, and I know you did Red Tails too, which had a lot of political, social significance, but how does it feel differently when you leave this film and, and you leave the set and you know that the film isn't over, like real life is coming out of this film? Like, how does that feel? You know, you look at the, the, the headlines of today with the marches and everybody standing up to snuff out the injustice of our judicial system and certain you know decisions that were made you know that movies like this are very timely it just feels like i'm doing god's will i'm i'm where i'm supposed to be in my career as an actor as an artist as a man as a father as a husband and it just gives me the strength and courage i need to continue to do what i do give our viewers a history lesson on who was fred gray and what did he mean to the movie fred gray was a powerful figure in the civil rights movement in that era. He was a, an attorney who sought the injustices of the people of, of our people and he represented those who couldn't represent themselves. He spoke on behalf of Dr. King in court and enabled him to uh, you know, enact these marches. He uh, represented what King was and that was a peaceful alternative to the violence that surrounded the people in the South and all over the United States during this, this period of time and uh, in many ways uh, was Dr. King's right-hand weapon in the fight against racism. I appreciate the time, Cooper. Thanks for the great role.